Fantastic. Hello there, Master Hellish here, and welcome back to my roller coaster tycoon world let's play and early access follow blog dev thing. Yeah, whatever. There has today been a mini update, so we're going to have another episode. Last time, we had the first major update since Early Access came out, and we built ourselves here the wooden roller coaster. Uh, thanks for your kind comments on the wooden co coaster. Uh, a lot of you liked the different ways that I built it, um, the curves, twists and turns, and the ups and downs that I put in it. I'm quite happy with it myself, to be honest, and uh, thank you for your comments. Also, thank you for your comments in general. So far, they've been very good. Again, uh, if you're going to say... Uh, if you think something is better or worse than something, I do prefer it if you say why. Okay, so I mentioned that there's been an update. Yes, there's been a mini update. So I haven't actually got the version numbers for this game at the minute. So we're going to call this Early Access Update 1.5. Because they... or 1.1. Yeah, 1.1. 1 .1, uh, because they've brought out what they're calling a mini one. There's a new ride. So let's check out the rides. Uh, I don't think it's Junior. I don't think it's Family. I think it's a thrill ride. Oh, and here it is, the Typhoon. Uh, it's a new ride. It costs a, uh, not a lot of money, but it's, look at that. That that looks pretty cool. I think we should put that in our park. But I, could we fit it inside the wooden roller coaster? No, no, we can't. Um, if we put it here, we're going to block off a lot of space to put like paths and stuff. Hmm. How about we put it down here? Can we? Should we put it down? We'll just put it down the bottom here. Oh yes, that'll do. I don't want it in that dark orientation though, so I'm going to hold shift and rotate my mouse wheel. There we go. 180 degrees. Um, let's just see if it line. Oh, hang on, where's it gone? There it is. Let's just try and line it up nicely with this path. So we've got. We've got. Let's try and put a snap on and see what. Okay. Let's put it up against the back wall. Uh, Here-ish. Hmm. Doesn't seem, doesn't seem to want to snap perfectly in the middle, but that looks pretty darn close. So this is a brand new ride as of today. Let's have a closer look at it. Looks interesting. Looks jungly. Uh, we haven't really got a theme for our park at the moment, but never mind. Now, let's try out the paths a bit more and play around with some of the different natures of them. So, these are going to be small. I'm thinking if we go back for a medium one, and I'm going to do a couple of straight bits. We're going to start from... Uh, we're going to start from here, and we're going to carry on with the same path that we've been using for a while now. Now, I'm actually going to use the price to measure the size. So we're gonna go six oh can we go how far can we go this yeah we're gonna go sixty dollars this way and then we're gonna go sixty dollars this way. It's an interesting way of doing it isn't it? Uh, then we're going to go and get a small path and we're going to use the uh, hexagon sci-fi. I like the sci-fi stuff. So we're gonna come out to hmm Let's see. Let's come out to $80 and try and come into the middle. Ooh, we hit... Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on, get rid of that. No, I'd, I want it to be a curved one, not a straight one. There we are. That's quite easy to get rid of. Okay, curve one. So we're going to come out to 80 There we go. And then we're going to bend it round... So it, sh it is snapping quite nicely there. So we're going to snap it to here and then do the same. Ah, uh, oh good. Angle to sharp. What angle? Oh, I see. Right, it's trying to do another angle. Uh, let's get it out to about there and bring it in. There we go. Oh, that's all right, that. No wrong with that like it. Um, can we connect this up directly to this? No, it, is, it doesn't. This, see, this is the one thing that I really wish that they did a bit more work on, was the paths. 
Uh, what if we brought the path out to like here and oh hang on a minute I was using curved path let's see if I can do it with a straight piece oh I can do it with a straight piece ah, okay that's fair enough we'll let them off this time we'll let them off this time yeah that works out quite nicely now the problem is is that we don't want uh, a straight uh, a straight cue we need that to come out to probably about here uh, there, and then back in Hmm, it's not coming in super straight, but it does link up quite nicely. Oh yes, I like that. That's cool. And let's open the ride. Now the excitement rating is quite high, so I think we're going to put the price up here. There we go, let's put it up to $5. Brilliant. I'm not sure what I'm going to put in this D yet. Uh, I was thinking maybe we could have a look at the plazas, because we haven't looked at the plazas yet. Um, what's that? User generated? No, we don't want to use it. Path, scenery, fences? No, we don't want to do. We don't want to mess around with fences too much at this stage. Uh, decor. Have we got? I'm sure. I'm sure. Some some source some source some, some plazas. Centerpieces, signs. Oh, here we go. So we got a downtown. Let's get the among the stars. Uh, yeah, let's get the among. Oh, it's a bit bigger than what I thought it was going to be. What about this one? Ah, uh, they're both bigger than what I thought they were. Hmm. Okay. Uh, that's not really what I want to do then, is it? Put one here. Or we could just have it here. Well, that'd be nice. Oh, yeah, that fits lovely. Na -na. And then what we'll do is we'll put some sci-fi paths leading up to it. So we'll go from here... To... Ooh, look at that. It's not quite straight, and I, I would prefer that to be straight, and I can't quite make it. It's snapping to the middle there. So, let's move that. Can I... Move tool. I haven't used the move tool yet. There. I think I have moved, I've used it now. Let's try putting that path in again. Where's the... This one, wasn't it? Oh, there we go. That's much better. I don't think it's perfectly straight. Oh, it does appear to be perfectly straight. Brilliant. Let's come out of here. Let's put that path... I'm going to redo this path over here. So we'll come back to that in a minute. We'll put... Oh, now look at this. It wants to it wants to hook up to these two junctions here. And I want it in the middle. What if I de-snap? No, it won't have it. The paths have a mind of their own of how they want to go sometimes. This is the one thing I think they would... I really wish they would sort out. I want that in the middle. What if... Can, can I Can I do that? Oh, I can do that. Interesting. Now, I'm going to get rid of this bit. Let's get rid of this. Delete, delete. There we go. Let's put that path back in. It was a medium... I'm going to try and keep this... Why, why won't that go... Oh. It won't go in anymore. It's in... Oh, it gets in the way of that. Oh, dear. Okay. Um, this is not good. Look at this, game devs. That, that needs sorting out, I think. I, I don't like it. Ooh. Ooh, I like that path. That looks cool. Uh, right. Maybe we can fix this by putting a small piece of path in. And then putting a medium piece of path in like that. No. Um, can we move path? No, we can't move path. We can only move objects. Let's mm, let's, let's come back to, back to that later. Right. Is this going? Hello? Oh, is that my mechanic? Who, whose animation seems to have been broken? He didn't like using that tool, did he? Oh, well, here we go. Uh, what I believe to be our first batch of participants for this brand new ride. Okay, so also in this mini update, uh, they've made some ch uh, changes. Uh, age positions, they've got a note here. Peeps now adjust their positions according to age to avoid clipping. So it looks like they should be like walking together better to avoid clipping. Doesn't look like that's been completely... Those two are walking inside each other, teleporting into their chairs slightly. 
Um, they look okay. And the other ones is, is the Peeps AI. Peeps are now move at all times. Apparently they were sometimes not moving in the past. Um, but they seem to be moving quite a lot now. They're doing okay. How's the general... Mo oh, hang on. Our new ride. Let's go check out the new ride. Is it starting yet? Waiting for this one last person to get in their seat. Get in your seat. Let's turn the path tool off. There we are. Ta-da! Right. Cool. Oh! Well, that is interesting. Oh, cool. It's making me dizzy already and it even hasn't even started moving yet. Oh, there we go. It is now starting to move around the curve. Oh, it didn't go very far. Oh! Now that is an interesting motion. Well, that is an interesting motion indeed. I don't think I've ever seen one like this in real life before. Um, but it's certainly a nice little uh, addition to our park. Some of the peeps disappearing there, bugging out slightly. There's these little kind of clipping and bugging out kind of glitchy things that I expect to be fixed before the games come out. Right, some people getting bored waiting in line at the wooden coaster. It's not a particularly... Oh my goodness, look at the amount of vomit. Oh, that that is not good. That That is a lot of vomit on the exit of the wooden coaster. Uh, perhaps we can put some chairs down. Chairs. Look, we need lots. Can we put chairs on the slanty rampy path? Uh, apparently only... Oh no. Ooh. Y yes. Apparently we can, but it's not the, the best placement in the world, and it doesn't like it if you're really high up there. Uh, peeps also seem to be ignoring the benches. Um, we'll leave those two there, and we'll put some more down here. Now, one thing I would like to see in the game that isn't currently in the game is the ability to do symmetry. So if you put something on one side, it automatically puts it on the other. That would be a lot easier for when we were doing these lampposts. Uh, it means that we'd be able to just pop something one side of the street and then we'd have one appear on the other. But unfortunately, I've got to zoom in, see how close it is to that little nub in there. And then just do something there and it's going to be fairly close. It's not going to be perfect. Well, I think I've got it perfect this time. Right. So these guys finish? Yes, these guys are finished. And it looks like people are happy. That's not bad. That's alright. There's a few people being ill in the garden. Why are you being ill in the garden? Ridiculous. Stop being ill in my garden. Uh, okay, let's try and sort this path out. So for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this link here. And I'm actually going to probably remove this path here as well. Okay. Um... There we go. We're going to redo that bottom section. Now, let's see. Uh, paths. We're going to start with a small one. We're going to come from there. And then, why won't that... Oh, it's the roller coaster looks like it might be in the way. Let's go down to there as far as we can. Let's link... We are snapping, so hopefully... No, that's too far. Yeah, I want a grid. But the grid's not helping me very much, I don't think. Uh, straight path. There we are. No, the grid, the grid just doesn't help me very well. I mean, when I put that there, that kind of... There we go. I think I did it this time. So I've given it a little bit more space. Hopefully that means that we can now uh, get the medium path to come off down here, which we did. And also we can do the small path. Oh yes, perfect. And all I need to do is move these trees and bushes. I'm going to try using the move tool again. Oh, that works quite nicely. And now there has been an improvement in the placement algorithm from the first initial release. Um, 
what we're going to be calling. Um, I don't know what we're going to be calling it actually. Why right, that wants to be up against? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Let's get my bush sorted out. Bear with me a second, folks. I just need to sort my bush out. Okay. Maybe I just need a new bush. Oh, is that just where it goes? I think that might be just where it goes from now. There we go. Right, I've got a path coming out of there now, which I didn't have before. Ooh, nice music. Um, now, what I'm thinking is, is to just continue that path on. So let's see. I see we can't go under the roller coaster, which is disappointing. Because I'm sure the roller. We'd have to delete part of the roller coaster. Oh, uh, God. Um. Okay, let, let's do that. Let's delete part of the roller coaster and see if we can put it back afterwards. So, stop the roller coaster, go into edit coaster mode. We're going to add a node in. Oh, God. And add a node in there, I think. What do we need to take that? We need. Well, oh God, we need to take that one out. Let's delete that. Oh, I can't delete the node. What does that do? Auto complete. I can't. I can't take it up. Oh, I know what I can do. We'll move it. So that it gets out the way of the path. And then we'll put it over the path later. Is that out of the way of the path? Really, you should be able to do this. Okay, I shouldn't have to mess around moving roller coasters this is one of two things that has annoyed me so far when building things in this game the first is the fact that the paths are too picky about where they link along with the objects and that i haven't been able to build under a roller coaster maybe there is a way to do it maybe i'm just not doing it right in which case please feel free to correct me see look that now goes over the path no problem at all I think that's more or less how it used to go. Um, I'm going to have to just sort this out here because it's a mess. Uh, let's go into free mo freefall mode 2. Level it out a bit, I think. Hmm. Maybe we can get it closer. Freefall mode 4. Bring it up a touch. Is that okay? Looks like it's all right. I think just need a slight wiggle in freeform mode three. Oh, oh, there we go. That's much better. Hopefully the peeps won't break then. Oh, the peeps going to be able to get under that bridge. Well, we'll find out. So let's turn the roller coaster. Uh, back on. Hello, roller coaster. We're done. Or do I have to test you again? Do I have to test you again when I've changed it? Fair enough. That's fine. I don't mind. Just hurry up. Whee! And it, it'd have been nice that I'd have been able to lay the path without having to move the roller coaster and then put it back again, but never mind. Oh, God. That bit is a bit harsh. That bump just there. Right. Past. Normal game speed. Everything looks good. Track. Place. Out of test. Open. Brilliant. Right, okay. Yeah, so I have been able to put my path under a track, even though I had to do it a dodgy way. Uh, I did manage to fix this. I think part of working with these paths is just learning how they work um, and the best way to work with them. I mean, it does need to be better. I will admit, it does. Need, the pathing path stuff does need to be better. But I, I don't know. I haven't noticed much of a difference in the peeps, but I don't think I paid too much of attention to peeps previously. 
They all seem to be doing pretty good, especially when they're at this zoom in level. They need to fix the bug where they jerk around at this level. Look at them jerking. Well, could that be just my computer? I don't know. Um, yeah. Well, the performance is looking pretty good. The sunlight is actually looking pretty good now. All the graphics from the first major update is good. And, of course, this brand new ride, I like it. Uh, it's cool. It's different. Would I change it? Maybe. These, these trees don't look the best on my computer, I don't think. But yeah, they're alright. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. That needs a mechanic. I'm sure one's probably on his way. No idea. Uh, can I get these bits to turn to the colour that I want them to? No. No, I don't think I can. Modify terrain. We haven't really done terrain yet. Let, let's play around with terrain a little bit uh, to finish off the episode. So what we'll do, uh, we're going to put a little pond in this area here. So let's try... Oh, oh, we can. We can just very... I did this a little bit in the beta. And you can just very easily and very quickly just... Def ah. Look at that terrain there, though. That's where it says you can't move this. There's a path. And it's very square and rigid, actually, along the edge of the path. So I think I'm going to fix that with... Oh, no, that didn't... Smooth? Oh, cool. Yeah, I'm going to fix it with a bit of smooth. There we are. Fix it with a bit of smooth. Uh, we'll leave this sharp edge in here. Uh, we'll fix this with a bit of smooth as well. Come on, smooth it out. There we go, that's better. And I do want to make it deeper. Oh, that's raised, lower. No, you see, it's it's pulling at the at the path round here. I, I random bumps. Oh god, that's a bit of a big tool. Brush size. Let's make the brush size smaller. Let's. Um, let's do some random bumps here. See what it looks like. Well, that's cool. Well, that's quite nice. I like that. Let's do some here too. Oh yeah, that gives it a bit of texture. Oh, cool. Yes, yes. No, we can't fit that in there. Oh, this, this park's going to look amazing by the time we've finished. Rifts. I think that's a little bit... Yeah. Just pass it. Oh, yes. The ground is now not completely flat. Gives it a bit of... Yeah, that's better. Right, now fixing this... Uh, smooth. Right, I've got a smaller brush size now. So it's smooth, soft round. Come on. Oh, if I use the smaller brush, this works. Okay, I was just using a brush that was too big before. There we go. Right, now, why have I got a big hole here? It's because I'm going to fill it with water. So we've got the water tool. We can add water or remove water. Look at this. Isn't that great? Look how it just sinks into the ground there. I love the water tool in this game. If you put some water there, it just dissipates away. It's quite cheap as well. So let's just fill... Oh, whoa. A bit too much? Uh, I'm surprised the peeps are getting washed away, but this is... Hmm. Let's put more in there. Is that the maximum I can fit in? Oh, it is the maximum I can fit in there. Okay, cool. Um. Let's just do a little bit of flattening around here. Or, or smoothing. A bit, bit more smoothing. 
yeah, so let's do a big fat flattened tool. I can see the brush a bit better now. Why is it not letting me? There we go. Oh, do I have to drag this one? There we go. All right, got those bits out there. Now let's smooth it down. Ah, oh, that's better. There we go. There we go. Side of the pond now looking a lot better. This this isn't smoothing. Come on, smooth out just a little bit. There we go. Brilliant! We got a pond! I want to put something in the middle of the pond now. Why is everybody screaming? Oh yeah, they're on roller coaster rides. Uh, let's just put a little peak in the middle of this pond. Oh, hang on a minute. The brush size is too big. Uh, yeah, I made that too deep. Water. Oh, water. Entity is underwater. What's underwater? I think we're okay again now. I think it was only... I think it was only temporary that something was underwater. Uh... Right, let's raise, put the brush size the minimum. We're going to raise it in the middle of the pond. Can I make an island? Hmm, sort of. Hmm. Make it more of a bridge than an island, isn't it? Oh, there we are. And I should do an island. I mean, it's not exactly what I wanted, but it's it's flipping close. Right, what we're going to put on it? A tree. We'll just put a tree. No, a rock. I could put a rock on it. That'd be very a very stateful statement. Have we got anything else we can put on it? Centerpieces. A cat. Doesn't fit. Is it? Was it a cat? I didn't see. A. a a statue. Photo spot. No, nope, we're not putting that there. Uh, what's that? Decor. Candy cane. Nope. All right, let's let's do an elephant. No, it's too big. A bush. Just a standard little. No. Let's put a tree on it then. Surely I can get a tree on here. Or is it too small? I think it's too small. Oh my goodness! Look at the size of that tree. Maybe we just need a little, like a little populous. Oh, no, 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 no. The land's not big enough. Land. More land, more, more, more land, more, more raising of land. What size is the brush? That's just too big, I think. Okay, what about the flatten tool? The flatten tool might help us here. Ah, brilliant. Raise. Lower. No, lower. Just that bit there. Good. Right, now flatten. Flat. I'm getting that. I, I haven't used the uh, land tool much. Flatten. Right, now that I've flattened it, I might be able to put a tree on it. If you flatten it, you should put a tree on it. Well, that tree looks ridiculous, so I'm not putting that one on. Uh, that one looks quite nice. There we are, let's put a tree on it. Just need to uh, pop that bit of land down again. So the land tool is good, it just needs to be a little bit smaller. Uh, you need to be a little bit more... Let me See, it won't let me lower the land here. There. It says no, no land... No, oh. Well, it's got a little spike on it, I'm going to have to remove that. Okay. I, I think I think this game takes a bit of practice with some things. There we go. There we go. That's better. Now I put my tree on it. Hang on. Let's turn snapping off. Oh, that's a lot easier. I was stupid before. Why was I trying to snap? 
Uh, if I turn snapping off and then do land tools, does that does that make the land tool a bit more roundy? Uh, let's go this way a little bit. Does it make it a little bit more accurate? I don't think so, really. Not really. Oh, well, we've got our tree, we've got our pond, uh, we've got our brand new ride, we've checked out the brand new ride, and, um, yeah, apparently the peeps animation should be better. And the general stuff that they're doing. There's still quite a lot of clipping with the peeps. They're still walking through each other quite a bit, so I'm not so sure about that. Well, there we go, folks. That's going to be all for now. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I've enjoyed playing around with these. If you've got any thoughts, ideas, questions, tips, uh, please feel free to leave them in the comments. I do read them all. But that is going to be all for me for now. Uh, yeah, I've been Master Hellish. It's been me on Roller Coaster Tycoon World uh, Early Access Update 1.1. Let's play, check it out thing. Goodbye for now.